Hi guys, it's me, Teacher Gorn. In our today's video, we will talk about how to find the product of binomials using the FOIL method. Your FOIL stands for the first terms, outer terms, inner terms, and last terms. So without further ado, let's do this topic. Now let us multiply these two binomials. So as you can see, we have 1 and 2, 1 and 2 terms. So we're trying to find the product of the two binomials. Following the following method, the first terms, your first terms are x and x. So you will multiply them. What is x times x? That would give you x squared. Next, the outer terms. The outer terms are the terms on the left and right side of this given binomials. We have the x and 5. So let us multiply them x times negative 5. And the answer is negative 5x. After the outer terms, let's talk about the inner terms. Inner terms are the terms inside the parentheses. And these are 4 and x. So let's, let us multiply 4 and x, 4 times x. So that would be plus 4x. Next, is the L or the last terms, the last terms of the two binomials, and that is 4 and negative 5. So let us multiply 4 times negative 5. That would give the answer of negative 20. And after doing the FOIL method, guys, what you need to do is to find whether uh, where, whether there are terms that we can combine, like this one. We have negative 5x and 4x. So we will copy x square. And as we add negative 5x and 4x, that will give us the answer of negative x and then copy minus 20. And this is now the answer for the product of the two given binomials as we multiply them using the FOIL method. We have x square minus x minus 20. Now let's proceed with x plus 3 times x plus 5. Using the FOIL method, the first terms, x times x, we have the x squared. x and 5, x times 5, that is plus 5x. Next, 3 times x, that is plus 3x. Last terms, 3 times 5, that is plus 15. Okay, copy x squared. Combine 5x and 3x because they are like terms. That is plus 8x, then plus 15. And this is now the product of the given binomials. In the next part of our video, I will give you two more examples for us to solve using the FOIL method. Now let's answer the third example. We have here 4v plus 2 times 5v minus 8. So remember FOIL, first terms. The first terms are 4v and 5v. Multiply them. 4 times 5 is 20. v times v is v squared. So their product is 20v squared. Next, O, outer terms, 4v and negative 8. Let's multiply them. 4v times negative 8 is definitely negative 32v. Next, inner terms. Inner terms are 2 and 5v. Let's multiply them. 2 times 5v, that is plus 10v. And last terms, for letter L, the constants 2 times negative 8, that is negative 16. Combine these two terms, guys, because they are like terms. Copy this one, 20v squared, negative 32v plus 10v is definitely negative 22v. Then copy minus 16. And this is now the product of the binomials 
4v plus 2 times 5v minus 8. Now let us have the last example. 7x minus 3 times 2x plus 4. Multiply these numbers. 7x times 2x is 14x squared. Next, 7x times 4. 7 times 4 is 28 with x plus 28x. Next, negative 3, 2x. That is negative 6x. Last one, negative 3 plus 4 since different signs that is negative or minus 12. Combine these middle terms, we have 14x squared plus, this is plus, 22x, then minus 12. And as you can see, it is easy for us to multiply or to get the product of two, the two binomials using the FOIN method. So, for your activity, I will give you item number 5. So, I hope you will try to solve this one, guys. And this is the problem. Try to multiply x plus 2 times x minus 1. And this is number 5. And I will add another number. Let's have number 6. We have 2x plus 5 times x plus 3. So I hope guys you learned something from this video on how to find the product or on how to multiply the two binomials using the FOIL method. Actually, FOIL method is an example or part of this CBT property. So if you're new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe but hit the bell button for you to be updated sa latest uploads. Again, it's me teacher Gon. Maraming maraming salamat. Bye-bye!